Say it here. You were in the Olympics. That's right. I was a decathlon in the 2012 Summer Games in London. I know Olympians don't make a lot of money. How are you going to be paying for this? My SSI is going to cover it. That's perfect, because they'll cover all your follow-up care, too. You sure you're ready to do this, son? I've never been more ready in my life. Hand me the scissors, Cheryl. We gotta cut this thing right up the center. How you feeling? A little nervous, I have to be honest. I'm just not sure what my children are gonna think. Who cares how your kids are gonna be affected? This is about you, honey. You're right. Now you listen to me. This is gonna take about six months to heal up. You'll need to use the dilator six times a day to stretch it out to keep it from closing up. The procedure has a high rate of post-op infection, but don't worry, your SSI will cover your care for as long as you need it. Honey, the first nanny from our ad should be here any second. She said she'd come right over. Well, let's hope she's better than our old nanny. There she is now. Hi, I'm George Alina. I'm here for the nanny interview. The position's been filled. You filled the position in the last ten minutes. We were hoping for a nanny, not a tranny nanny. I resent that. I identify as female. Goodbye. Okay, next up, Cirque du the Sun cancels upcoming North Carolina show. They say they disagree with parents' positions on tranny nannies. The high-flying troupe, known for its gravity-defying act, was set to perform this Saturday. No show, says Cirque du the Sun until North Carolina homeowners change their attitudes towards tranny nannies. Cirque du the Sun founding partner, Guy, joins us live. Hello, Guy. Looks like you've brought a friend with you. Yes, this is my friend, Georgelina. Well, hello, Georgelina. Welcome to the show. Hi, Peter. Great to be here. So, Guy, you're taking a stand. That's right, Peter. We at Cirque du the Sun believe in equal treatment for all people, and we will not perform in North Carolina until homeowners open their doors to tranny nannies. And how do you respond, Guy, to those who say you're only taking this stand because it will bring in more ticket sales from liberals? That's simply not true, Peter. And what about your upcoming shows, Guy, in various Middle Eastern countries where they put homosexuals to death? Will you be canceling those shows as well? That's actually all the time I had for today, Peter. Thank you. Damn it. I thought we were going to leave the Middle East out of this one. Are you really going to perform in Middle East countries where they kill gays? Yes, we are, George. The money's excellent. But what about the whole, I thought you were here to support me? Give me a break, George. I'm trying to run a business here. <laughs>